Where's Adrian? Still asleep, I suppose. He'll come eventually. What do we have for breakfast, honey? I knew you'd ask that question. Well, we have eggs and bacon as well as pancakes. Now that's what I call a nice little breakfast to start the day. May not have been so little in my case though. I'll be right back. Time for a bathroom break. That's just weird. The man I married to wasn't even born in America, but his appetite is unique. Suppose that's just our father for you, Mom. Let's see how Adrian will learn from that. You think you two aren't guilty? We sure aren't. We're immune compared to boys. I mean, so are you, Mom. I wouldn't say I am. I mean, yeah, right now I'm on a diet, but when it's Sunday and your father is grilling, who can say no? Certainly no one. Exactly, Jana. Okay, girls. I suppose I'm off to the bathroom. Isn't Dad occupying it now? Oh, man. I'm certainly not going to use it after him. You forget we also have a smaller bathroom right next to the kitchen. Yeah, I forgot. And what if I want to use it? Just kidding. I just want to know why you girls and mom talk about bathrooms. Isn't that something for boys? Seriously now, does your father talk to you about that? Just typical for boys, I suppose. Suppose you want breakfast. I'll bring it to you. That's for sure. Strange start into the day. Good morning, Adrian. Good morning, Mom. You're a sweet little brother even after all. I agree. I'll be right back in a minute or two. Suppose Adriana had the second biggest breakfast after Dad. No comment. Mom, shouldn't we test Adriana's math skills? He seems to need help with that. Good idea. What is 1 plus 2? 3. Correct. You can have three gummy bears after breakfast. Had I known that, I would have said 100. 